showing you how to make this giraffe. Alright, so I'm going to start off by making the head. I'm going to be doing six single crochet in the magic circle. Next, I'm going to be doing two single crochet or an increase in each stitch for a total of 12 in a round. Then I'm going to do one single crochet and an increase all the way around for a total of 18 in the round. Then you're going to do two single crochet and an increase in the next all the way around for a total of 24 in the round. Alright, then you're going to want to go ahead and do four more rows with 24 single crochet in each. There we go. Now we're going to go ahead and do two single crochet and a decrease all the way around for a total of 18 in the round. Alright, next we're going to do one single crochet and a decrease all the way around for a total of 12 in the round. All right, now I'm gonna add the eyes. These are 12 millimeter plastic safety eyes. The link is in the description. I normally place the eyes six rows down and five holes apart so that there's four spaces showing. And then stuff it. Alright, then we're just going to do six decreases, a slip stitch, chain one, and break off your yarn. Alright, to make the body, I'm going to do six single crochet in a magic circle. Next, we're going to do an increase in each stitch for a total of 12 in the round. Next, you're going to do one single crochet and an increase all the way around for a total of 18. Then you're going to go ahead and do 9 rows with 18 single crochet in each. Alright, there's 9 rows. Now I'm going to do 1 single crochet and a decrease all the way around for a total of 12. Alright, then at this point we're going to stuff it. Alright, now we're going to do 6 decreases, a slip stitch, chain one and break off your yarn. Alright, now I'm going to make the neck. I'm going to start off by chaining 11. Then you're going to attach to the first chain. Alright, then starting back into the first stitch that you did, again do another row of 10 single crochet. Alright, and now in this row we're going to do 4 single crochet, followed by an increase all the way around for a total of 12 in the round. Then you're going to do a slip stitch, chain 1, break off your yarn. Alright, now for the snout or nose. You're going to put 8 single crochet in the magic circle and you're going to go ahead and do 2 more rows with 8 single crochet in each. You're going to do a slip stitch, chain 1, break off of your yarn. Alright, now I'm going to work on the ears. You're going to go ahead and put 5 single crochet in the magic circle. Then you're going to go ahead and do one single crochet and an increase all the way around for a total of seven. Next you're going to do one single crochet in each for a total of seven in the round. 
And you're gonna go ahead and do an increase in each stitch for a total of 14 in the round. And you're gonna go ahead and do seven decreases. Do a slip stitch, chain one, break off your yarn. All right, to make the feet, we're gonna start off in the brown. We're gonna go ahead and do eight single crochet in a magic circle. And we're gonna go ahead and do another row of eight single crochet. All right, now we're gonna go ahead and change colors. Do three more rows with eight single crochet in each. Slip stitch, chain one, break your yarn. Make four of these. To make the spots, I just do six single crochet in the magic circle. Slip stitch in the first. Chain one, break your yarn. Normally make five of these. All right, now for the antenna, I'm gonna do six single crochet in the magic circle. I'm gonna do another row of six single crochet. All right, this round we're gonna do one single crochet and a decrease all the way around for a total of four in the round. At this point, I lightly stuff it just because it gets harder in this next round. And then just do a, another row with four single crochet. Go ahead and do a slip stitch, chain one, break your yarn. And I'm just gonna close the head and the body like this, just weaving in and out. I'm gonna pull this closed and tie a knot. Alright, then I'm going to sew the neck onto the head, roughly towards the back of the head. And you're going to stuff the neck and sew it onto the body. It looks a bit awkward until it's all sewed on. Stuff and then sew on the snout. I'm gonna have the ears relatively lower so that I have room for the antennas or horns. Then sew on the legs in the appropriate spots. Speaking of spots, sew those on too. All right, and then you just got a stick on the tail. I'm just going to attach it directly. I'm going to do a slip stitch. I'm gonna chain five. I'm gonna pull this through. Then I'm just gonna take some of these scrap yarn pieces. I'm gonna fold them in half like this. I'm gonna go through the last stitch on the tail. Bring the scrap pieces through and do a chain with those, or pull those through. I'm just going to cut these short. I cut it like this, and then I'm just going to use the needle and then fray the ends. And there you go.